bring it back. What is going on ladies and gentlemen, it's Lambo back with another video for you guys and today we are going to be talking about the new tournament that is coming tomorrow. Yes, the tournament is coming tomorrow. It's going to be a draft tournament, so that's really, really cool, but that's what we're going to be talking about today. So I'm going to play a little bit of a season game in the background just so you guys don't have to look at a loading screen the whole time and I didn't feel like recording this with um, like a face cam today, just, I don't know, um, but a lot going on. So. To start, there's going to be a 15 round draft. That's how everyone do it. There is going to be players up to 100 overall, not 105, just straight 100 overall. Uh, it starts at 4 p.m. Eastern. So whatever time that is for you, that's going to be 3 p.m. Central. I, I don't know what the other times are going to be. 1 p.m. Um, West Coast. I know that. Um, I I'm pretty sure that's it. I don't know. I don't know. I know those uh, those three times. Um, you get it's going to be every two hours you get to draft a new team. It's going to be an eight hour event. So it goes from 4 p.m. Eastern to 12 a.m. Eastern. And then you get eight free entries because you get uh, four tickets. So you get a free entry no matter what. The tickets are only if you want to re-enter. It sounds like if you get a, the only way to get eliminated is if you lose. So it's basically play till you lose type thing. So make sure you guys are playing your drives properly. Um, it is going to be set up like a like a league versus league or like a arena head to head. So it is going to be match based. Thank God it's not overdrive. Otherwise, that would be the worst thing in the world. Um, uh, adding to that, you can also purchase more, um, like if you lose, you get those tickets where you can re-enter. You can also purchase more tickets. It's going to be either a hundred Madden cash or it's going to be, or sorry, it's going to be 50 Madden cash or a hundred gems. So if you guys really do want those wins, then you can pay a hundred gems. And honestly, I really want those wins because the milestones and like the rewards you get from them are really, really cool. But if you if you do get eliminated when you when you use a token or 100 gems or 50 Madden cash to get back in the game, that doesn't mean you can redraft. Uh, you have the same team for two hours, so you can only redraft at the start of the new two hours. You have the same team no matter what at the uh, like for that two hour period. Adding to that, for every win, um, you get 500 coins and a chance at a two to seven round collectible. If you lose, you get 100 coins and a chance at a two to seven round collectible. Um, the wins aren't that great. What the what is great or what's really good is the the milestone rewards. Those are a lot, lot better and a lot more worth it. Uh, so there's eight milestone rewards. But as you guys should know, since it is um, like arena, you get a max of 29 points per game. So if you score eight on three drives, that's 24 points. And then if you win, you get 20 uh, you get five extra points so a total of 29 points which is great so it helps you guys rank up really quickly but there's eight milestones in total um the first one the first two you guys are going to be able to get is the 10 point and the 25 point milestone so you guys can knock both of those out literally within one game uh, if you guys are if you guys are winning and getting the max 29 points which is awesome and the 10 point milestone is going to give you an 80 to 84 road to the draft player and a three two to seven uh, collectibles for the actual draft promo. The 25 point milestone is going to give you an 80 to 84 base elite player. So it's not the best, just a base uh, base elite player there. An 80 to 84 road to the draft player, um, a standout collectible for the draft promo and three two to seven round collectibles once again. Um, that's the only, and then it goes to 200 points. They jump to 200 points. You get an 80 to 84 base an 85 to 89 draft player. So an 85 plus draft player, which is really, really dope An 80 to 84 road to the draft player, a standout collectible and six, two to seven round collectibles. So as you guys can see, these rewards are actually pretty, pretty decent. They did not give us the short end of the stick on these, which is great because EA is being really, really nice with their promo. They realize how hard it is to get these collectibles to get, complete these sets. So it's great that they are, are taking the initiative to really give us um, some good rewards out of this out of this tournament and hopefully we'll be able to do it in the future as well because it is very very cool the maximum amount of points you can get or the maximum milestone is 500 points um, i don't know how many games that is i believe it's around i mean if you're getting 24 points a game plus 5 29 it's probably going to be around 16 16 to 18 games i think for you to be able to get the 500 point that's it that's at the max 16 to 18 games to be able to get the 500 point milestone 
at the 500 point milestone, you get a Madden Max stamp, right? A, not a badge. You get a Madden Max stamp. So I'm guessing somewhere along the milestone list, you get a badge maybe is what I'm guessing. But you get a stamp if you get 500 points max. So you know all the pay to win teams are going to definitely pay for entries so they can get another Madden Max stamp. So they can get another 105. Um, a 90 to 94 draft player. So a diamond draft player, which is dope. Uh, two standout collectibles, which is also really, really hype. And then three two to seven round collectibles. I'm not sure why they don't give you like 10 or like a lot more two to seven round collectibles, especially if you're getting 500 points. I guess it's because you're getting a Madden Max stamp. Um, hopefully they give you the opportunity to get some Madden Max badges as long as you reach those point milestones. I'm going to be going for the 500 points just so I can uh, talk about like how many games it took, uh, how how to get there and all that fun stuff but that's what i'll be doing uh yeah like i said it starts at th tomorrow at 4 p.m eastern so that's thursday at 4 p.m eastern i have an exam to take um, but luckily it's before 4 p.m eastern so that's good for me um, but yeah that, that's basically it all the info that i have on it um it's gonna be really really fun um i i believe it's gonna be really really fun i i really like that they're doing tournaments again it just makes it a lot more fun and I, I do like they're doing the draft style and not your own team. I think it'd be cool to add your own team in the future. Maybe do a draft and your own team just because you do work uh, really hard to get a good team in the game. Um, but the draft is also really, really cool. So remember, it's 15 rounds. It's not 19. The, the draft mode right now for the season mode is 19 rounds. The one for the tournament is only going to be 15. They're up to 100 overall players. So make sure you guys are drafting like I'm not going to tell you who to draft because I'm going to beat you guys. But no, <laughs> uh, make sure you guys are drafting the right cards as we get Minka Fitzpatrick right there. Wonderful. But yes, make sure you guys are drafting the right cards. That's really going to help your team out in um, in the draft. You guys should know what what positions and stuff those guys are like. If you see 100 overall Lamar Jackson on the board versus like 100 Tom Brady, I hope that you're going to take Lamar Jackson. It's just kind of an obvious selection. But that's basically all I know on it. I don't want to make the video too long. I just want to give you guys some some information on that tomorrow. As regarding today, it says on the news that something should come out today. At the time of recording this, I'm recording this really, really early in the morning. But on the calendar, it says in between New Masters and Standouts 420 and 423 right below at live um, draft night, there's this question mark right below New Legends, which nothing came out yesterday, so it's got to be today. So at some point, probably at time 30, they'll be talking about what is new today. And I'll hopefully be able to get another video out about that today. So a little double upload, but we'll see. Uh, I do have to do quite a few things today and study and all that fun stuff. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope this guy helps you guys out. Make sure you guys are going to run the right plays and get ready for tomorrow for that arena-based um, draft tournament, which is going to be really, really fun. Other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.